Okay, everyone, welcome back to Auburn Claire Beauty and welcome to another five minute review. Now this one might actually go over five minutes and I think it's gonna be worth it. This is something that I actually <laughs> saw on Facebook. Uh, I've been inundated with the ads for this product and I'm like, what the heck? Let's give it a shot. So what it is is from a company called Il Maquillage and their big thing is that they give you a 90 second quiz that you fill out and online and they come up with your color match either for concealer or for foundation now the company itself i did check it out has lots of different makeup items that you can buy but their big push on these ads is the color match now the other thing that they have that a lot of people like is the fact that there's a two week money back guarantee on them. So you can try, they send you a full size product and you can try it for the two weeks. See if you like, if you do, then you pay for it. If not, you can send it back and you're only out the shipping cost, which for me was like five bucks. So the package arrived and, and I will say this about their customer service. The first time the package said it was delivered and I never saw it. I wrote to the company and right away they said, well, we'll either send you out another one or you can cancel your order and we'll also send you a $20 gift card on one of our products should you choose to have another one sent to you. So I'm like, oh, that's good customer service. And sure enough, they sent another one out and I received it and they said they wouldn't start the 14 day until I received the second one. Then we did see the first one. So right there, right off the bat, great customer service. Uh, it came in a package and I ordered a concealer. This is the package. Minimalism is dead is what it says on here. So I was like, well, that's a little big packaging, but of course minimalism is dead. There you go. Explains it all. So I opened it up and I get this box right here. Now let me explain. I, I, I opened the package. I got the box. And I pulled out the concealer and that's where it stopped. I have not used this concealer at all. I want to wait. So this is truly a first impression. I have not played with this at all. So this is going to be really neat. But this is a big box for a little concealer. Well, what I thought to be a little concealer. Let me show you. <laughs> and this is what I saw and I'm like, oh, I have to wait. This is too good. So I opened it up and have a nice bright pink inside. We have shipping invoice. We have some, you know, the black paper shreds here, trying to make it look fancy, I get it. And then we have the product here, right here, this big old thing right here. And I, and I start to feel the weight. I've had concealers that are close to the size, like in length, but this is heavy and I'm like, holy cow. So I go and I open it up and look at this thing. I'm like, are you kidding me? This isn't concealer people. This is a freaking weapon. Like what are they expecting to happen? Like you're here doing your makeup and all of a sudden someone breaks into your house and, and you're like, oh my God, I have a concealer. You can bludgeon the person. And then all of a sudden you have, you know, someone that's been bludgeoned, passed out on your floor and you're calling the cops and you're like, oh, oh, I have a bruise. Oh, good thing I have some concealer. I guess this really is a concealed weapon. <laughs> I know they're terrible but I love them. But seriously, this thing is big. And then uh, to give you comparison, this is the Benesit Boing Cakeless uh, Concealer that I've been using forever and a day. It's 0.17 fluid ounces. This is the Il Maquillage, 0.23 ounces. That's why it's so much bigger. They give you a ton of product. So I'm like, all right, that's worth uh, sharing with everyone. So I'm gonna do a couple of tests. I'm gonna zoom us in here. So I have nothing, I have nothing on my face right now at all. And I'm gonna do one eye with my color corrector that I usually use, and then one side with uh, no color corrector, and then I'll use concealer in both, and we'll see how it does. Today's a good day because I'm not having a great under eye day. 
So this would be a good day to test it out. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of concealer, or not concealer, color corrector on my eyes right there. And then I'm just going to take that and spread it out right here. I always try to, excuse me, take a tissue and just blot the extra. All right, now let's take a look at this. And this, <laughs> the concealer, you gotta love this. You gotta have a sense of humor with this company. I started reading the names. You gotta have a sense of humor. For instance, this concealer, and I'm not making this up, it's called Fuck I'm Flawless in 2.5. <laughs> <laughs> multi-use perfecting concealer all right so let's open this this puppy up okay nice little doe foot applicator and and what's really nice it does have a see-through panel right here so you can actually see the color and I'm gonna do what I normally do which is ooh, that is bright we'll see how I how this covers and, and uh, see if it matches. Looks a little bit bright, but we'll see. And let's go ahead and take this on around. Oh, well actually, that is not, once you spread it out, that's, that's pretty nice. That's what all the ads said. They're like, are you seeing this? Are you seeing this? I'm looking in the monitor to see what you guys are seeing. That is a pretty darn good match to my skin tone here. I'm gonna take just a hair more. Wow, color wise that is um, seriously spot on. Now my biggest thing is the caking and so we'll see how it does on that. By the way, don't mind if you hear any kind of um, thumping. Da, 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 da. There's a toddler that lives upstairs, the upstairs neighbors, and that's him running across the apartment up there. And put some on this side. Well, that um, color-wise, that is pretty uh, spot on. Now, just looking at uh, covering the darkness, it does a quite a good job. I still see some darkness here, but I usually do. I usually would put some cons uh, some highlight there to help cover that up. So I'm gonna blot it. I'm doing everything I do with my normal concealer. So just blotting the excess. Now let's, I'm gonna zoom you guys in just a little bit more. That actually looks really good. I'm looking in the monitor to see again what you guys are seeing. That's nice. Now just feeling it, it feels very weightless which is really nice I don't feel like I don't see any big cakiness I'm going to put just a little bit of powder on here again just like I would my normal concealer that is actually really nice that is um that is definitely a uh, good color match. I, I, I am impressed. I did not think when this first went on that this was going to, as light as it was going to match come out, but uh, that is pretty. That is like really kind of spot on to my eyes. I'm, I'm very, very happy. I'm gonna see how this wears and um, you know, see if it cakes up. So I'll have to let you know how that does. But for right now, for a quick, obviously it's not quite five minutes, but a quick review, uh, this is good. This is really nice right now. Um, I, I The price point of this is $28, but for 0.23 ounces, it's, it's no 
more expensive really than like my Benefit Concealer or some of the uh, mid-luxury line concealers, Tarte, Shape Tape, they're, they're all running in that 20 mark. And this is 0.23 ounces. And it's a weapon. I mean, it's hard to beat this a multitasker. It's a multitasker. <laughs> All right. If something dramatically changes, I will let you know. But for right now, I am loving this. This is good. I will be keeping this. And I hope you're having a great, wonderful day, afternoon, morning, even night, wherever you are. If you like my content, please like, subscribe, share, ring that bell. Make sure you get notified of all my uh, content. And if you like my um, makeup looks or you have not checked those out, I'll leave a couple links in the description bar below so you can check out some of those looks. All right, everyone, we'll talk to you soon.